Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Legends out of Breath of the Wild. So I think to start off, I'm gonna go get the sand boots back, probably, since those are gonna be very useful, probably at some point, but not now. Uh, and then I think we're gonna try and get a few more shrines, maybe. We have a hundred shrines. That's a really good starting point to finish the game. Uh, Koroks are gonna be just whenever, and I also want to get a little bit more better armor, even though I probably don't need to at this point, since my my best armor gives me like 72 defense. Is that right? 78 defense, no mind. <laughs> it's even better than that. But anyway. So if I can get a few more Lionel Guts, I can probably upgrade my boots a little bit more. Although there are different armor sets that I'd like to upgrade at some point. Oh, it's just you. But, uh, huh. Look, I feel like someone should tell you that you have kind of a sulky look about you. You keep walking around looking all miserable, and you'll never get a girl. <laughs> oh, what am I saying? Sorry about that. Awfully con uh, condescending of me. I've just got wooing on the brain. Girls have always vexed me. But right now, she is all I can think of. Sorry, but I don't have time for other girls right now. Let me let other let alone other guys. Know what I mean? If you need something, do me a favor. Ask someone else. Just gonna go back here so he doesn't see me. I don't think it matters. I could probably get changed right in front of him and he would have no idea. Hey look, I've got the same equipment as that other guy that was just here. Yeah, you A traveller swore he saw you in the Gerudo Highlands. I've been gnawing on my fingernails with worry. I mean, all that talk about the sword was just chit-chat. I didn't think you'd go up there with, without snow boots. Anyway, are you okay? Feast your eyes! <laughs> what? It really exists? And you went searching for it without a decent pair of snow boots? I mean, the Gruta Highlands are unforgiving. I doubt I could survive there. And I'm burly. Who are you? The snow boots, give me. Oh. Yeah, you did risk your life to fulfill your promise, after all. It'd be pretty uncouth of me to drop my end of the bargain. Just a second, I'll take them off. Well, now I'm barefoot. But if you're happy, then I'm happy. And what's more, this whole episode has endeared you even more to me. Your cutely greedy side. Your sassy, playful, fully rude side. Your unexpectedly tough side. Um, would you g -g go out with... Not a chance. Ugh. I knew... I kind of knew you'd say that, but would it have killed you to let me finish the question? Okay, goodbye forever. We've got the snow boots and the sand boots now. That's actually really good to have both of those and not have to worry about letting them go. Look at that. I'm so happy with that. <laughs> Fortunately, they don't... I don't think we can upgrade them. Maybe? I should probably double check that before saying that. Um, But, you know, we have them now, so that's good. So now let's go... I guess, uh, over here or up there. Actually, let's go up to this one up here. And then go down from there. Okay, I need to also change my equipment quickly. Since I have the snow boots back, that makes walking around up here easy as well. Um, there we go. Dramatic drop in defense, but that's okay. Oh my goodness. That's kind of funny when you lose all your things at once and they all come back at once. I kind of want to use them all up again to try and get them to like all happen at once. Anyway, let's glide down this way, more this way. Probably should have used the Death Mountain as a reference point.
We could have also gone from other places down this way. This is actually kind of a weird spot on the map though, because there's not really anything connected to it. Hello, hello dragon. Saw you last time. Comes through this area, like I said. Okay, I'm gonna just get my stamina back. And then go! Go! Straight down the mountain. <laughs> straight down the mountain. Oh, there we go. Actually sliding now. Oh, and it's raining. Oh, it's it's raining. If I could see further in front of me, that'd be great. That'd be actually really good. Okay, let's go... Um, actually, let's go over this way to start off. I was thinking to go this way after, but I guess I'll go this way now. Let's equip our best defense. And keep gliding over this way, please. There's a line up there that I'd like to take out. I think it's a strongish one. I mean, they're all strong, but some of them are stronger than others. Mipha's Grace has not returned to us yet, so that could be a problem. But I've also got the best defense on right now. So I should be alright. So let's equip a different weapon for now. And then take it out. Hello. Okay, 4,000 HP. Oh my goodness. Starting off strong, I guess. Nice. Do some damage. Not a lot of damage because he's got a lot of health. But I'm getting these quick time perfect dodges done fairly well at the moment. Oh my goodness. So good. Oh, there he goes. Wasn't gonna have it make it too easy for me. Oh my goodness. Unfortunately, he doesn't freeze. But that's okay. I'm just using this weapon because I have it and I need to use my weapons. Great Frost Blade is bad at damage, but that's okay. That's the whole point. Um, uh, what would be good? Anything, really. Let me use my Guardian Sword plus plus. I need to actually target him as well again. Let's do the Bosa's Fury. Please get up. There we go. Do some damage. Just a little bit. He's stuck. Oh, good. Come at me. I missed a half health. Oh my goodness, not again. Ow. I was hoping to get you with that. Oh my goodness, dodge, dodge, dodge. Gonna use Obosis Fury again. Taking down a lot of his health. Please mount. Thank you. I can't see anything right now, but I know I'm doing damage. Oh, bad. Oh, but I blocked it, apparently. Just a little bit more. Okay. Flow Rush. He's so close to being done. And... There we go. Let me just quickly see if I've taken pictures of all, of all this. Looks like it. Just gonna grab all that I can, which is not a lot. Um, I'm gonna look just around just a little bit. There's some treasure up here. Gold rupee. 
And another gold rupee. I guess it's just there because it's uh, next to a Lionel. Anyway, let me just quickly look around some more. Doesn't look like there's anything else over here. So let's head up this way there, I guess. Also, did I get some Lionel guts from that? I'm just gonna check that. Um, yes I did, so I can upgrade some more of my armor, which is good. Do I have a speed potion still? Probably not. I do! It's not a very good one, but it's still one. Gotta take advantage of this speed potion while I have it. This is a very interesting looking area here. <coughs> Some hard to truffle, that'll be good. For infinite health. Oh, hello. Funny seeing you there. Just another Korok. In the Lanayru region. Like, I saw this rock and I was like, is that a Korok? And then I saw the Korok. Balloon, and I was like, oh, that's probably a Korok, though. Getting some amber from under these rocks. Pretty good. Oh, and I hear that. There's a Hinox over here. I don't know if I want to take it out, but I guess I could. I still have a bit of the Bosa's Fury left. So let's do that. There goes my guardian sword. That's okay. Oh my goodness, he's not gonna last very long. He's not gonna last long at all. I can just regular attack him to death. And he's gone. Cool. Uh, do I want the royal habit? Probably not. Let me throw that off just for a second so I can check this royal broadsword. Yeah, I'd prefer that. Overall, just it's it's not about the the attack. It's more about the um the type of weapon, I guess. Although I do like spears, but still. Anyway, I don't think we're gonna keep going in this direction anymore. Um, I don't even think it connects to much other than over here. Um, instead, let's go, I guess, directly over this way, a little bit more. See what we can find. It's very windy over here. I can hear Cass. I can also see there's a Korok here. If I can find a rock. Probably if I go up from here, I might find what I need. Oh yeah, te definitely plenty of rocks up here. This is one of the areas that was mentioned in Cass's book, so I need to go find him. See what he says. Okay. Where is Cass? There. And there's the thing over there, for the shrine. Tem... Uh... I don't even know. Tempest... Durus... Wind. Oh, I was sure that I would... <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, I was sure I'd be alone in so remote a place. Pardon me for not greeting you sooner. Oh, uh -huh, it's you. Although I guess I shouldn't be surprised to see you here. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear an, the ancient verse passed down in this region? Let's hear it. Oh. Excellent, without further ado. He breaks the rocks that serve to bind above the tempestuous bay. On wings of cloth and wood entwined, he lands on the altar to open the way.
The tempestuous bay from the song could be this very bay. But what sort of wings are made of cloth and wood? Mm. It's a juicy riddle, but one I may never puzzle out. Take care, and may the light illuminate your path. Okay, Master of the Wind. So let's get started. And let's blow up this rock over here. Gotta put that down. Okay, that works. Now if I can... I don't know if I can go up any further than this. But can I go in any other directions other than that way? Guess I'll just go this way anyway. Uh, but I believe what we need to do is actually open up some rocks around the place to let the wind go everywhere it needs to go. Which is a lot of places. Gonna grab some of these crabs, I guess, just because they're everywhere around here. There's a rock there that we need to get rid of. That's funneling the air through this hole here. So now, let's go over here and blow that up, if I can. Oh my goodness, I got the fish. Sorry fish, I was just trying to blow up this rock. Now let's let air go through that hole. But it's never just two, is it? It has to be three. Also, hello there. go around a little bit more. Well, I should probably actually go back inside the rock because the rock seems to connect with everything else so I can work out what's missing. Oh yay! My favourite. So this hole here needs something. Oh, I see over there. It's a good thing that that rain passed so I can shoot this rock with a bummer. That's allowing all of the wind to go into this hole. Pushing it out that way at full blast. And now, we should be able to glide all the way over to there from that rock. Probably. It's lit up now, so... I might want to climb up first, just to make sure I have the right amount of height for this. Okay. Let's line ourselves up, and let's go! And land on here, I guess. There we go. Master of the Wind complete. And it is a blessing, so that's gonna make everything fairly easy. There's a lot of blessing shrines. So many blessing shrines. Great flame blade. Oh, but my inventory's full. How dare my inventory be full? i to get rid of this Dragon Bone Club since it's not a rare-ish weapon. Okay. So, I think now, well, so I did think there was actually going to be, oh, maybe there is on that island there. I did think there was another shrine over in this direction, but I didn't find one when I killed the Lionel over here. 
Because this is where I thought it would be. After killing the Lionel, maybe one would spawn, but no. Nope. So I guess there's something somewhere else, probably. Because there is another uh, shrine in this region that I don't know where to find. Lanayru region. Lanayru is a fairly big region. With the large water, like... What would, what would it be? Well, I don't know what it's called. The, like, shallow water area. There is the main. Everything else. But anyway, I'm going to go over this way and just double check that there isn't anything of value. On that small island, probably. And then I guess I'll head off into somewhere else and fight some more Lionels, probably. Oh, there's a treasure chest there. Is there monsters to fight? There are. But also... Set some of them on fire, I guess. Set multiple on fire. Gonna switch to a basic weapon. Ow. I'm gonna take out the scout since he's just shooting at me. Oh, please take care of the enemies. Oh, don't shoot me. Who do you think you are? Take that. And you. I think this is a silver. What what kind of thing are you? Yeah, you're a silver Lizalfo, so I haven't taken a picture of you yet, so I'm gonna take a picture of you. Okay, there's that gone. Frostblade, I guess. There goes you. Switch to another frost frost blade. Well, this is amusing. You're floating in midair and you're frozen. Don't jump back further. You're on the edge of the edge. Just gonna push you over this way, I guess. Almost done, and there we go. Now, what are you gonna drop for me? Got some good ore from that. Also, want to see what's in this treasure chest. Since it's red, find one of these types of chests. Just some ice arrows, okay. <clears throat> Grab some of these parts, and let's keep going in this direction. There are a lot of enemies to fight over here, like there was two strong enemies in the regular enemy camp. Because there's the Lionel and the Hinox as well. Those are the strong ones. Really does seem like there should be something else here. Okay, maybe there isn't over anything over here, there's a raft to get over there. Oh, looks like this is a Korok. So I guess there isn't a shrine over here, and then there's a shrine somewhere else that I just don't know where it is. Oh. I didn't realize that this was the type of Korok it was going to be over here. I thought there were... No, there are more rocks. So there are two Koroks over here. Yep, it's gonna be over there, of course. Where'd it go? Back up, yep. Please don't rain. 
The weather likes to change itself a lot. Depending on where you are in the world. 150 Korok seeds. Okay. Just gonna get this rock into place and get another Korok. And now I think it's time to go somewhere else. So let's head on over to... Um... Probably this shrine here. Way back on the Great Plateau. Okay, and let's head towards the Colosseum type place over this way. It's been such a long time since we were first here. Oh, it might be a little bit of a walk over there. I could try getting another horse, although I don't even need to take it to a stable. I could just get a horse. Come on. Soothe. Soothe. Now let's go. Oh, is this the path I should take? This is probably the path I should take. I think an untamed horse doesn't follow the road as much. No, maybe it does. Let's just keep going. Oh, don't go through the river. It's okay. It's okay, horse. What's up there? Something up there. There's also these rocks here for a Korok that I'm going to pin down. Don't know where another rock is going to be, though. There's a glow on top of that mountain over there. There's a lot of things to just see. Oh, horse, what are you doing? I'm just gonna leave you. Goodbye, my horse. Friend. Okay. Oh, is that a rock I could use? I guess this is a rock I could use. But I'm not aiming to get that Korok at the moment. I'm aiming to get a different Korok at the moment. Um, I guess this ice arrows will work. Let's just jump off of here and shoot that and fall more than I'd like get this Korok here there's still a lot of Koroks in central Hyrule don't fall that much please why <laughs> oh well time to climb up this rock to the Colosseum area I don't know what it's actually called what is it called does it have a name I guess it doesn't I guess people just know it as the Colosseum. That's good. Because we're going up against a very tough Lionel in here. Possibly the toughest type of Lionel. I think it's the first one I ever defeated as well though. Okay. Silver Lionel. Probably the strongest kind. Five thousand HP. Oh, it's starting off with an explosion. Ow. Please hit him, thank you. I was hoping that he didn't get out of range because he looked like he was getting out of range of that attack. Good, good damage so far. Oh, here he comes. Ow! Oh my goodness. Come and get me. Come 
come and get me. Oh my goodness, fire rush. Ow. Um, I have a few bits of basic food. I'm gonna just get rid of that. Oh, really? Donkey Kong 64 time. Oh my goodness. That's not how you're supposed to dodge that, but it worked. So let's keep going. Now would be a good time to have the barbarian armor leveled up so I can do damage and have defense still. And actually, since I've got such good uh, defense anyway, I could switch to the barbarian armor on one of the three slots to try and get more damage done. Ow. Oh, nice. Hit it in two different ways, hitting it with the slam of the axe and also Obosa's Fury. Oh, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. I learned from last time, you need to get a lot further away when it does that. Here we go. Fly rush on that. I don't think I've managed to get a fly rush in that before. In that particular attack, so that's really good. Less than half its health remaining. Let's keep going. Oh, so good. Keep doing this attack to me, it's really working out for me. Okay, I need to switch weapon. Um. Oh, what do I want to use? I still have a lot of good stuff that I need to use, and a lot of bad stuff as well. Oh my goodness. That's a move that I can't really dodge extremely well. Okay, one-fifth of his health to go. Can probably start going all out on him. That's a lot of slowdown right now. Okay. Oh, my sword broke. That's a shame. Oh, my frost blade broke. That's fine. Use up Druk's protection and... Oh, he's so close. And he's done. Very nice. Let's grab his stuff. Of course, he has some really good stuff since he's the strongest kind. Also, apparently I've never taken a picture of a flame blade. Um, it's a fairly average stuff except for this Lionel shield. Savage Lionel shield. So let's grab uh, that if I can, please. One day. Savage Lionel shield. This ultimate Lionel shield is only you are used only by the white-haired Lionels. It excels at defending against even the most brutal attacks uh, and cutting down powerful foes when wield deflecting. Okay, well I'm gonna drop a shield for that. Definitely. So let's get rid of... I guess I could get rid of my regular Lionel Shield. Can't grab this bow. What, what other bows do I have? Um, I could probably get rid of something. Quick Shot is not really what I need, so I'm going to get rid of that. That was a good trade. Okay. But anyway, that is it for this episode, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.